Craven the Hunter is the story of the making of a villain. My son, they are prey. We are predators. This is a standalone movie. This is Sergei Kravinov becoming Craven. It is a family saga. You are exactly like our father. You don't get to do that to me anymore. But it is also a good old fashioned gangster story. This is not about money. This is about power. JC truly does deliver a raw, gritty, real world movie. We actually use real locations outside in the weather. I'm so lucky I get to do the stunts. Old school, real, raw, barefoot, running through the streets of London, doing flips and running off the wall because you needed to have that kind of authenticity. An assassin will use his methods for the animals. There was some element of bloodlust that he seemed to love. The six of us, and only one of you. There was a justification for it. There's six of you now. And that feels good. But he is also this very inconsistent, ethically <laughs> compromised individual. Embrace who you really are, son. But yet, still, you're rooting for him. Once you're on his list, there's only one way off. Where's Mr. Tagli? You're standing in him. Just ticking the boxes off the list. What have we got next? OK, Chorney, we'll go for him. Where is he? In a prison, sure, no problem. The choice to make an R-rated film allowed me to be far more honest about that journey. He's not a superhero. He's a man who's been trained and a skilled hunter and killer. My son, we are hunters, the greatest the world has ever known. There's a man going round taking names. Why do you hunt? My and father puts evil into the world. And who to believe? I take it out. Whoever Tell him about this hunter. Once you're on his list, there's only one way off. You're just another man hunting for a trophy. When the man comes around, embrace who you really are, son. And you will become a wetsum. Craven the Hunter comes around.